We're here talking with Mike Avila, who is currently the points leader in the national standings in world speed skiing. And Mike, you were leading yesterday in the 50 mile marathon. And what happened? Well, we lost two rocker arm studs, leaving us down with seven cylinders. So we just had to kind of limp on in. We ended up third, but loss of about 400 RPMs. Third overall. Right. Right. Yeah. So how do you how do you like Clear Lake compared to the other places that you're skiing? It's uh, it's the best. We have uh, saltwater is a little faster to race on, but there's just no the course is just ain't as fast. We have a place in San Diego we race on that course is really short. Mission so, Bay. Yeah, so it's just a disadvantage to ski down there. This Clear Lake is the ultimate skiing. Why why is saltwater faster than freshwater? The buoyancy, the, just the texture of the water. You notice when you get in uh, in saltwater, if you put it on a boat. When it's just on there, it feels slippery because just the texture of the water makes you go faster. In your, your training, obviously skiing, marathon skiing, and circle speed skiing, you have to be in excellent physical condition. What type of uh, conditioning and training do you do? Actually, I do two and a half hours a day of uh, running, bicycling, and a lot of weight training. The weight training you don't is actually uh, more of a safety precaution. You need some, you need some strength, but you get your strength when you're skiing. But the, uh, a lot of the weight training is for safety, for in case you fall. If you have some muscle attached to something, you know that it's going to be harder to pull it. You may pull a muscle, but you won't just get ripped to pieces. That's the biggest uh, disadvantage to somebody who's really slender. If they fall down, they're going to get ripped apart. The speed will rip them apart. We're talking today with Donna Bryce of Southern California. Donna currently holds the world's record in the quarter mile speed skiing for the women's division. Donna, congratulations first of all on winning the Pedrati Memorial last weekend. And too bad about yesterday breaking. What do you think about today's women's open? Is that going to be a close race? Yeah, it's going to be tough for me because I've got the outside and Debbie's got the inside. And she's tough. We're pretty, we're pretty even skiers. It just depends on who gets it out. Debbie Lester? Yeah, so. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. I, I don't know if I'll be able to ski behind my own boat because of um, mechanical problems, but we'll just see how it goes. Conditions look like they'll be pretty good today. The water is fairly calm. Yeah, it'll probably roughen up by the time we, we get out there, and it's going to take some tight driving. Right. So. How do you like skiing at Clear Lake in comparison to other race areas? I love it. This is my favorite place to ski. I yeah. love it. I have good luck up here. I love the smooth, flat water. I really love it. I just, it's like I just turn on up here. I train all week and I like it.